Peggy 3. Here we go on a lap of Interlagos. This anti-clockwise circuit makes it one of the most physically demanding tracks for the drivers on their necks especially. Running down towards turn one, a great overtaking opportunity using the DRS as well. Slow it all down, easy to outbreak yourself here and reserve the speed in turn one to open up turn two and then hard on the throttle around turn three. Don't use too much of the exit curb here. That will upset the car at high speed. Now the run down the hill towards turn four. Brake marker boards on the right hand side, down through the gears into third, use a bit of the entry curb, not too much of the exit, you don't want to run off there, it will pull the car out of the circuit. Now on the run down towards the fast right hand corner of turn six and seven, a beautiful chance to feel the high speed balance of this car before slowing it all back down into the hairpin of turn eight. Use all the curb and more, and then in turn nine, it's quite often the car will get away from you, understeer or oversteer on the exit turn 10 nice straight braking slow it all down once again and be patient on the exit here as it goes off camber slightly before this flat out left hander and the run towards the penultimate corner 50 meter board slow it all down don't be too greedy here because this is the most important area of the track in terms of traction and as you head up the hill you need that momentum with you particularly in a racing situation if you've got a car behind you they will have a go down into turn one and as we head back towards the start finish line that's a lap in Sao Paulo